we're doing another installation here. We have done, uh, we have showed you a lot of residential installations. Uh, we had um, comments and requests to show the um, liquid cooled installations and uh, more commercial or industrial. So this is the day we are doing this installation uh, in the uh, Saint Laurent area of Montreal. As you can tell, this is a, a metal factory and we are doing a 48 kilowatt uh, liquid cooled. Uh, there is uh, a lot of distance between the location of the transfer switch and the generator itself. So we already passed the wires and uh, we have mounted the transfer switch to start with the connections. Um, they are doing uh, some part of the lighting and the server rooms um, uh, and the office area so that during the power failure uh, they have uh, the factory functional. Uh, it's a pretty good option. The liquid cools are really good units. They are durable, designed for this size, um, not really big, uh, medium size uh, commercial units. Uh, we can do installation up to 250 kilowatt uh, of um, liquid cooled units, uh, which are 600 watts. So 250 kilowatt, 600 watt. Um, that's it. So we are going to show you more details uh, during the process of the installation. When we receive a request for a Genevac uh, generator installation, we have to check with the customers of the loads that they are putting on the generator. So if there is a, a 15 amp or a 30 amp or a 60 amp or a 100 amp, how much voltage is it? It makes a difference. So we have to check with them all the appliances that you want, they want to be on the generator. And then we are going to provide them with the exact size that they need. We can't go really smaller and we can't go uh, a lot bigger. So it has to be something uh, that they need. A little bit more than what they are asking today so that they, there is enough room in future if they, are, if they want to add some items on it. But it can't be a big difference between you know, what they want to be on the generator and what we provide to them. Um, this is what we discussed with the customer uh, before ordering the generator and um, you know, uh, doing the placing the order so that uh, we will need to have a meeting with them to make sure what we provide is what they need um, and then we will proceed uh, with the rest of the project. Checking the requirements of the customer is the first step of doing such a, such a big project. <laughs> 